And now to the two people who died out in the cold. One of them was a woman in a wheelchair at a DART bus stop. Police say she had been outside for days before she died. News 8's Rebecca Lopez reports. For several days, people saw an elderly woman in a wheelchair at this bus stop in the Fair Park area. But I know she had been out here for, uh, ever since last week. This morning, Broderick Azuni says he found her on the ground near her wheelchair. Her face was turned blue. She was a bright skinned, light skinned black woman, but her face was turned blue. I shook her and she was real hard. You know, I can see that she was dead. The woman had been at the bus stop overnight, and residents believe she froze to death as the temperature dropped to 15 degrees with the wind chill at 7 to 10 degrees. But she had clothes on the bottom of her body, but she didn't have no clothes on the top on the sleeping bag. Residents say they did offer to help the woman, but she refused. When people tried to help her, she started cursing people out. When police carried away her belongings, there were only a couple of blankets, a sleeping bag, and a few other things. Not enough to keep someone warm in the frigid temperatures. It's so ridiculous how, how, how stuff like that happens out here, you know. Especially in society, in this neighborhood, you just freeze to death all of a sudden, you know. A man was also found not far away from here in a homeless encampment. It's believed that he too died of hypothermia. The medical examiner's office is yet to rule on either of these cases. But the woman who died here died not far away from a grocery store, a community center, and just feet away from a church. Rebecca Lopez, Channel 8 News.